Welcome to Malibu. 21 miles of scenic beauty. Welcome to my vlog. I'm standing right here on the PCH, Pacific Coast Highway, going towards Malibu. And I was thinking, why not actually record when I'm vlogging? Today I was vlogging earlier on Venice because of the situation with the homeless. There's some sheriffs there today again. So I vlogged about that. And now I'm going all the way. It's one hour drive. I'm going to the Neptune's Net. There's a whole bunch of movies that were filmed there. And I need to get some footage for some of my vlogs I'm gonna do. I don't wanna say exactly what I'm gonna do right now. I'm just gonna take you with me to show you how a day of vlogging is. And since I'm on the way to Malibu, I thought I'm just gonna stop right here. It's a really cool surf spot. And I'm gonna show you a little bit about Malibu. Every time I come here, I have to think about my mom because when we visit Malibu, she always looks at the beautiful flowers. And now I got more appreciation for flowers than before. And this is on the way to Malibu. We are here at Topanga Canyon. See the street sign? I remember when I came from Germany on vacation to Malibu, I did the same thing I'm doing right now. I'm just walking around, I rented a car. Now I have my own car and I'm driving around. It doesn't feel like working. I'm actually working right now while I'm doing a vlog. A lot of people think it's not work, but it is work. Right now I'm just filming, but you gotta edit it. You gotta put music on it. But right now it feels like I'm on vacation. It looks like I'm on vacation. People that live in Malibu, they see this every day. And I believe those are all the locals that come here. There's no international traveling right now. So those are the locals surfing down here. And there's some more locals down that way. And those people work here on the beach, Los Angeles Fire Department, they're lifeguards. It's not really the most interesting job, but it's a really good job. You get paid well and you're in the sun every day. And another great perk of being a YouTuber is that you get to see all those places. I would have never stopped here. I would have gone to a different beach. So today I'm just learning something new because of you guys. If it wasn't for you, I would not be here today. Cactus in Malibu. There's one thing I enjoyed when I was younger, laying in the sun every day. I don't really like to do that anymore. I don't like to lay for hours in the sun and try to get a tan. Those days are over. Alongside the PCH, I got some really cool fish restaurants. You can get some good fish here. This is America to me. Every time I went on vacation, I stop at places like this and I just take pictures of the motel sign right here. Sometimes they had like a neon sign there. I love stuff like this. This is America to me. Look at this old Topanga Ranch motel sign. I don't know what it is, but I love to have this in your living room, you know? All weathered, it looks so cool. And this used to be at one time a really popular hotel. And now, nothing is here anymore. Have you ever had a Wu-Tang clam? Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da, ta -da, ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. There's so many things you can do. You just have to do it. I never hiked here. I should hike right now. And I don't even drink any wine. More fish restaurants. This is a pretty cool house. The lady does not know that she's gonna be on German in Venice. They do have a pier here in Malibu. But it's definitely not like Santa Monica Pier. There's nothing on here. They just have a restaurant here in the beginning. Let's check it out. Nice restaurant on both sides. A lot of those houses belong to celebrities. And oh my God, look at this. Could that be Arnold's yard over there? He's probably suntanning right there on the boat. Or maybe this is Sly Stallone's boat. I don't know, but somebody with money. 
like I said, there's nothing really on the pier, but there's a beautiful view. I have vlogged before, right all the way down there is Pamela Anderson's house. And this is where all the celebrities live at the colony. Those guys have no problems right now. They're just trying to catch the ultimate wave. I'm on vacation, but I'm sharing this only with my phone. But behind the phone is you looking at me. How cool is that? I'm by myself here, but thousands of people watching my video. So I'm actually not alone. Look at this, they got this swing here. Why don't we just try it out? Hopefully he's gonna hold me. <laughs> yeah, that's strong, Even the lady behind me, she had to laugh. I think I'm gonna make this whole little trailer shake here. Everywhere you go, German engineer. I like this color though. San Diego Black Forest. I thought the Black Forest is in Germany. Here's one more thing I found that's better in America than in Germany. You can actually fish out here from the pier. You don't have to have a license. In Germany, you can't just fish anywhere you want. You need a license and then you need a test and then you gotta pay for it. Malibu love, California dreaming. And then you got all those houses in the hills. Nice airstream. And look at the houses up here. Here in Malibu, they got all those little stores. I don't know, do you remember what this used to be? If you've seen the movie Last Action Hero with Arnold Schwarzenegger, this used to be the VHS store, video store right here. And if you come over here, you can see Arnold. I match up this picture right here perfectly. This is where Arnold was standing, right here. This is fantastic, incredible. Now I'm standing at German and Venice stands exactly where Arnold was standing in the last action hero. Now I'm the German hero here. Those are the Malibu mountains and you can see some of the bushes are still burned from the fire. Even the palm trees here, they still burn, but there's some really nice houses up here. Sometimes it's just nice to drive up a street you've never been on before. And if you live in Malibu and you want to go on vacation, but you don't know where to put the dog, Look at this, they have a dog hotel. This is the dog hotel. This is the PCH, Pacific Coast Highway. And you know whose house this is? This is Cher's house. Yep, 75 years old she is. She has this beautiful house here, right overlooking the ocean. It's all nice fenced off. If you see the picture in the back, it's absolutely stunning, the pool she has there. Here in Malibu, they got this really cool restaurant, cafe. It's called Paradise Cove, but I recommend to park your car alongside the PCH. You can park on this side and this side. I think they copy German and Venice. Welcome to Paradise Cove. And the reason why I'm telling you to park on PCH, you just gotta walk down maybe like three minutes. I mean, if you have $35 to park or $50 on the weekends, you're more than welcome to drive down this little way, but why not just walk down there and pay nothing? I mean, going up is probably gonna be a little bit harder than going down right now. If you wanna eat in a restaurant, you have to purchase food for at least $30, and you only have to pay $10 for four hours. Another Airstream, welcome to Paradise Cove. Bienvenidos, welcome, aloha. Willkommen, Brukrap Restaurant. Sheesh. You got Paradise Cove over here. Look how beautiful this is. You can walk all the way around. But this is the pier where Britney Spears was recording her video. And there's a picture of her right here. Check this out. And then if you look a little bit here, that's where she was dancing with the whole crew right here. And now Mike is dancing here. Well, if you're not a Britney Spears fan, you cannot relate to me. Excuse me, were you here when Britney Spears was filming? I'm talking to you. Uh, 
No, he's shy. I could actually use this video for my Fast and the Furious vlog. Normally I would go down here and take a picture exactly where Britney Spears was standing to match up the picture, but I have shoes on right now. I don't really want to get wet, but see this pole right here? This is where Britney was standing. This is a really cool place to hang out, eat, and swim. So you can rent those little booths right here, but what I'm here for is, this marks the spot where the Beach Boys in 1962 did their cover album, Surfing Safari, which would be right there. And that's where we're going right now to match up the picture. That would be basically it in 1962. That's where they were doing the photo album cover, right here in Paradise Cove. And if you pan a little bit over, they were doing another photo shoot right here. And if you don't know, now you know. I'm on vacation. It's hot today. I just saw Rosie O'Donnell in one of those cabanas. Whoo, it is hot. Whoo. Yep, so far I had a wonderful day. I like those little signs they post everywhere. Catch a wave and you're sitting on top of the world. Right here is where Brian O'Connor was racing the guy in the Ferrari. So this is absolutely incredible for me to be here. This is Neptune's net. A lot of movies were filmed here and that's the only reason why I came here today. Those are the four pictures I want to match up. Here we see Johnny Utah talking to Tyler in the movie Point Break. Then we see Brian O'Connor coming here with his car, sitting here, Vin Diesel, Paul Walker, and this is Tom Cruise in his movie Losing It. So let's match up the pictures. Many more movies were filmed right here. This is where Robert Downey Jr. took off in Iron Man, this area right here. You just see flying up. Brian O'Connor was racing the Ferrari right here on the PCH. And then afterwards he pulled in right here into the restaurant. And this is the scene from the Fast and the Furious. So I gotta do a big shout out to the manager. Normally this place is closed inside, but he let me go in just to match up the picture. We got Lauren Patty and Keanu Reeves in Point Break. Johnny Utah and Tyler, he walked right through this door right here. And believe it or not, Tom Cruise walked into this door in 1983 in the movie Losing It. And they did a food fight inside the restaurant. Also a scene from Iron Man 3 was filmed in here. First I thought they filmed it down here, but if you come down here, you see the hill going down, this part you can see in the picture, and there's the sign, no alcohol, behind this RV. So this scene would have been filmed right here. See, it took me about an hour to drive here, and then this camper parks right in front of the picture I want to match up. You see the background, you see the hill going down. But you can't really see the hill going down and you can't see the railing over here. Sometimes stuff like this happens. I was so happy to come here to match up the pictures, but I have to come here maybe another time. Leo Carrillo State Beach. So many movies were filmed here. It's also a pretty nice beach. And maybe you recognize this scene here in the 1984 film. Karate Kid, Daniel's son, was playing soccer right here. Remember that? Not much has changed here. The three bad guys from Karate Kid coming down here on a motorcycle. And look at the tower, the lifeguard tower looks exactly the same. This sign used to be a little further down here. And check this out. Yep. This is exactly where Michael Jackson was standing with his Ferraris, the whole Jackson brothers. They having a good time here, Instagram. Don't fall though. The clouds are moving in. Wow, what a day today. First I was vlogging in Venice, a little bit about the homeless encampments. Then I was doing this vlog. And then I did another little bit of another vlog. So 
I've done a lot of stuff today. I'm really happy. First, I just wanted to drive all the way to the Neptune's net, match up those three, four pictures, and then drive all the way back. But then I had this brilliant idea, and I said, why don't I just vlog on the way there and show them how Malibu looks like? And I'm really glad I did it. I know I don't really know you right now. You're watching my videos. I want to say thank you very much for that. But maybe one day I bump into you and I get to meet you. Anyway, you know what to do. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, push the notification bell. Yeah, and maybe you want to subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. I see you then. Just saying for Malibu.